Now you, when you go into these tunnels, mines and stuff, uh, you can see task finished. Uh, we can pretty much see some things here, but uh, you see this, we are going to make these defenses later on. Well, hello guys, I brought in uh, a little earlier than anticipated. And the reason for that is because uh, I figured out uh, there is somewhere I should probably show you guys now. Because you might end up going there uh, and wondering, mm, what's this? Why haven't Nubi showed us this? This is right where we start. Yep. So I figured I would show you that POI today. And if you wonder why do you start picking up paper, well, it's a good source of burning uh, kind of your uh, small burning things, among other things. But yeah, that's why I brought you in. Now I'm just going to search this house over here, Ooh, and this trash. Now I found a screwdriver. Yes, I found a screwdriver. So I picked that up. I also uh, chopped down some, uh, well not chopped, but mined some stones. I didn't bring the stones, but I brought the iron. I brought the uh, sulfur and, uh, and we brought the uh, coal. I just left the stones. And I advise you, uh, if you have a pick with you, even though it's a crappy pick, uh, take out every stone you find, grab the sulfur and iron. At least sulfur and iron. Uh, coal, uh, you decide you're going to need it later, but sulfur and iron, you will need a ton of. So just grab it. That's my advice. Just check this one for good measures. Uh, take that sewing thread and needle also. We're going to need a lot of, but uh, let's kind of figure out where we at. See our uh, bat is almost done. Uh, we can read that so we can make some roof welder set. We have that, we have that, we have that, we have that. And that and that. Uh, we could kind of equip these. Uh, let's do that. Uh, do I need there? Uh, can I do anything here? See, I also started to pick up the metal saw. I can't remember exactly what I need for now. I also picked up another car battery because. Well, the more uh, the merrier. <laughs> I'm going to throw this light stick in there. And I'll show you later why. But I need to fill up on my battery like that. So we are heading to a place and I think we have that on our to-do list. Uh, find the hidden catacombs. Uh, it should be nearby. People could be there. Well, I can tell you a uh, big secret. Something's there. And you decide what it is. You see, sulfur, stone, sulfur, coal, stone, stone, iron. Just chop it down. Or pick it down or whatever. Like that. Then I go into here. And drop the stones. Yep. And oh, that's one. I need this. I will take that and the weapon repair kits. And there should be uh, there's a stone. Yeah. All the way over here and just follow this along the kind of rocky mountains there 
uh, you will find either stone uh, deposits or uh, bamboo deposits. Now, when this respawns, it will either respawn as a uh, stone deposit or a uh, bamboo deposit. Yeah, kind of different. Yeah, and it's kind of a 50 50 chance on what it comes back at. But you see, there was no stone there. But look at this. Yeah, look at this hole in the wall. Yeah, look at this. Now you, when you go into these tunnels, mines and stuff, uh, you can see task finished. Uh, we can pretty much see some things here, but uh, you see this, we are going to make these defenses later on. But soon it will be extremely dark. Yeah, I'm gonna show you. Oops, yeah, I didn't have to show you. That's how dark it gets. And now we can throw this and you see how much that lights up. Now the different uh, kind of sticks light up differently. And that kind of disappeared on us. Oh, hey, hey. Yeah. And he dropped some. There's not one. Now. Whether you want to melee this or not, that kind of is all up to you. Uh, I thought I had some more light sticks on me. Where's my light sticks? Is it under ammo? Yeah, there it is. Let's see how these are. But we can pick up the green one, pick up the nails, the rags, duct tape, and school bus. Yeah, we're going to show that. But let's do a red one. And we kind of lost that too. That kind of happens sometimes. There we go. And that's how much that lights up. And if we test the green one further in, and throw that green one over there. I like the green one the best. I think they light up more than any of the others. Or you can use your flashlight. Now these will kind of light for uh, ever, I think. I don't know, at least until you log out. Uh, but this place is kind of, we can kind of find good things here. Uh, so I tend to kind of visit here. Uh, as long as I'm in the neighborhood, I usually go in here. Because there are some good stuff here. and this and uh, don't need that now uh, food will take oh yes yes now there are things on the shelves here as you can see so sometimes you kind of have to go easy to find a can see them all this and let's see good stuff yes very good stuff take that This is kind of closed up for now. We got a new task. What the hell was that? Find other catacombs. Okay. So we need to find some other catacombs also. There are several places around. And no weapon. And ammo. Yep, we'll take it all. Anything in here? Oh, seeds are always welcome. Small bookshelf, rags. I'm not sure about the weather set. I think I have it. Toolbox uh, is always a great spot to look. We need this later and a good fire axe. And here's another notepad or notebook. And fireplace cooker, stone, I'm not sure. 
we'll use ketchup, don't need that kitchen knife, I'm not sure how many we have, but you, uh, my experience is they are kind of hard to get. Now, while we're in here, we're kind of safe for now, so we might as well take that time to kind of sort things out. And we could uh, eat you, eat some bananas, drink you. This is kind of worn down soon. Yeah, return this. Yeah, we have that. We have that. And we have that. Uh, what else can we do? <coughs> mm, nothing at this moment. Nothing there. Nope. Okay. So that's kind of this place. Uh, it's kind of dark, but just keep walking and the light will come on. <laughs> Unless it's dark outside. <laughs> so how... Uh, yeah, we don't have much carrying capacity. But I have kind of decided that I am doing the barn. Yeah, so let's run down to the barn. And the reason for that is... Uh, we need more solar uh, panels, so hopefully we will survive this. Yeah, I died here more times than I can count. Uh, this is kind of, uh, yeah, uh, it's hard no matter what, uh, if you ask me. Maybe I'm just sucky at it, but I think this is one of the hardest POIs. Uh, you can either make it almost without dying at all, uh, and you can uh, uh, really struggle, and I mean really struggle. So hopefully we'll be able to do all this in one episode, <laughs> might be a bit longer, we'll see. But my advice, do not enter this before you are full of stamina because we are doing some running around. Yes, we are. Well, let's go. And this is how I always do it. And we got that one, and we got these ones. Yeah. Oh. out these spitters as soon as possible and now we are actually quite safe now these spitters usually drop ammo yeah. like that and that and then we'll take uh, all this you know what I'll just take all and then drop that uh, because that weighs a lot, but we got a uh, large dev collector, nice, we needed that. Here's solar cells, we got four of those. Now this respawns kind of every 24 hour in game or something. Now these advanced crafting things, here you see large batteries, solar cell, and isotherapolopop, yeah. So this is a good place to kind of go and get loot. Now we are overweight, but that's okay. That is okay. And you see there's a lot of things downstairs. We'll take care of that later. Water reservoir, nice. Now let's get back here and read the recipes uh, that we found. Uh, we have that, we have that, we have that. We'll read that, nice. And apparently we have that. So, first of all, I want to take out that uh, stupid thing over there. And this is where the crossbow really shows what a good weapon it is in the beginning. You can just stand like that. 
Now he's dead. And now I want to take out this thing. That should be 20. So let's see. One, two, three, four, and five, six, and seven. Takes a while. Nine. And eleven. Well. Thirteen. Fourteen. And fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Did I miss a count? I don't know. 18. 19. And let's see now. 20. Always 20. And now we can start up and do the other things here. Now I'm overweight, so I can't kind of jump. So I have to go like that first to kind of get here. And I want to pick up that head, I think it is. Yeah, infected head. And we can just start picking out these ugly puggies if we kind of get them closer. Take yeah, just pick them off one by one. Like that. And you see, we're getting glass shards. We need every glass shard we can find. But it doesn't seem like these spiders will come for us. There it comes. Now, sometimes they actually come up the stairs. Uh, they aren't supposed to be able to do it, but they kind of climb on each other or uh, jump and stuff. And yeah, it happens. Trust me, it happens. Like that. Well, there shouldn't be any more spiders left, but there might be. Get all of that. Well, as I said, we are overweight, but I don't care at that right now. Oh, that's not a hook. Uh, we could use that dynamo. Oh man, we are really overweight. why I do that. <coughs> now there might be a thumpy around here. Yeah, there he is. And we will probably get poison this time. As we go into the green smoke, then I'll get poisoned, but I have no intention of that. We should take a medical. Uh, nope. Now, if I wasn't overweight, I would kind of jump here and there to get that, but I'm too overweight to jump, so I can't do that now. <coughs> But I'll show you that in another episode. I'll break the water. What kind of fruits do we have here? Yeah, don't need that. But this is the barn. And we got uh, a lot of good stuff here. That we're going to need. And let's check that. Nothing. And now we can go and see here. Uh, grab that. And uh, I'm grabbing 
doing this. I'm not sure what I need, but is there, yeah, all right, sticks. Now we are uh, pretty overweight. So the smartest thing you can do now is actually to head back to base. Yeah. Uh, that's going to take a while. Uh, can we eat something? Yeah, we can eat you. Oh, we got friends. We got friends. I got him. There he goes. So let's carry this home. Now, you could either kind of avoid everything and go straight home if you want to. That's really up to you. Or you can go through those POIs up here, depending on where you're headed, I would assume. But I'm going to take the road and check out the cars on the way. And I might even kill that bear if he's in the way of going up. Now, the reason why I chose to do it this way now uh, that's because I would, was hoping to get another car battery uh, because then we can make two battery stations and they kind of work in uh, pairs or uh, threes or whatever uh, I'm not sure about how much they kind of take but one equals something, uh, two equals double something so the more batteries you have the more battery of power you can store and it doesn't really matter what size they are, they will just kind of add up. So if one stores 50, another 200, and you got two of each, then, then you got 500. So, easy peasy. Yeah, as long as you got the room to store them, I advise to build as many battery stations as you can. Because uh, they will continue to kind of gather up even if you're at the base or not. As long as you have uh, uh, battery capacity, your solar panels will produce current and store it up. So, and you will use a lot of power. You will use a ton of power. And eventually, uh, when we get electrical and all the bad defenses, <laughs> that takes power. Lightning takes power. All your station takes power. Uh, there's a drop over there. Soon we will uh, consider getting a car also. Yeah. Haven't decided what car, but I really would like a pickup truck if I can find it here. Last playthrough I didn't find that before. Um, oh, now I'm really slow. Man, I might have to ditch some stuff. <laughs> I really want these. I really want these. Yeah. I really do. And there's a backpack lying in there, just floating in there. That kind of happens sometimes. You see, there's a stone floating there also. <coughs> but yeah, and what do we have here? Linen and a saw. We don't need either of them at the moment. So. But this is going to take a while to kind of walk home, so uh, if you like this episode and you want to see more, then please smash up that like button and hit subscribe. And if you want to get notified about new releases, well, then you need to find that bell. Other than that, leave a comment, join my Discord, or all of the above. I want to thank you all for hanging out with me, and I hope to see you again next time. And I'll continue walking home like this. And I think I'll also do some rearranging back home uh, before I bring you guys back in. I might go on some more loot and resource gathering. We'll see. Uh, but I won't build anything until uh, I bring you back. So, once again, stay safe. Take care. Bye-bye.